Well, there has been an arrest made in connection to the abduction and sexual assault of a nine-year-old girl. Detroit and Farmington Hills Police confirmed today the suspect was taken into custody. This ends a four-day manhunt after police say the girl was raped at a home near Berg Road in Detroit. They say the victim was lost and walking near Eight Mile and Grand River in Farmington Hills when the suspect offered to help. We do expect DPD to share more information on the arrest and the investigation tomorrow morning. Two other former security guards are now formally charged in the 2014 death of a man at Northland Mall. Lucius Hamilton and Aaron Marie face a judge today virtually. They joined John Sieberlein and Gavin King pleading not guilty to involuntary manslaughter charges. Prosecutors say the guards pinned 25-year-old Mackenzie Cochran to the floor at that mall. The Oakland County prosecutor at the time decided against charges, but Attorney General Dana Nessel's office did review the case last year, and Nessel says new evidence led to the charges. Here at the Department of Attorney General, we created one of the first state AG conviction integrity units to address cases where people were wrongfully convicted of crimes they did not commit. But it is equally important for us to recognize that justice is also undermined when those who are guilty of abhorrent crimes are allowed to go free. And today we hope to correct some of those errors. All of the men charged are due back in court later this month. They each face up to 15 years in prison.